we switching up the structure this time. Uh, my friend said that I should take a video too of actually while I'm working. So right now we're midway through and we're doing shoulders and abs. So here we are. I'm just gonna try to keep going. And So, we got four sets of 15 here, and then then I gotta hit abs too. So it'll be a nice, uh, nice different one compared to what I've usually been doing today. I got up at 515. Hey Google, volume four. 515. Uh, did my morning routine, went outside, did my outdoor workout, walked three miles with the weight vest, uh, played around the golf, went to church, and then, uh, you know, kept going from there. Now it's four o'clock in the afternoon, midway through the workout, gotta go to the airport in a couple hours, uh, got an iron for the week. It's uh, pretty good. So this one, I'm uh, gonna superset this one so that way I can just continue to drive everything. Um, we're gonna see how this thing's gonna fit. So here are the weight vests. That's like their new home now for the next couple months. Let's see, Let's see if I can get a good spot. That work. Now I got 15, 12 taps, and then I'm right back to, to shoulders again. I think that was like 17. I always forget to count, forget my count. So I just go for the, the highest number that I'm 100% confident of. So, right. yeah. Yeah. All right, now we gotta try doing that set of this thing. I always like, uh, I like what David Goggins said. He said, he said a lot of people say, life's a marathon, not a sprint, but you know, he made a good point. You looked at the Olympics, did you watch the Olympics this year? Did you look at the marathon runners? We can't keep up with them for, you know, a mile, even two, three miles. So, it seemed like they're sprinting compared to us. They're running five minute miles for 26. I can't even run one five minute mile right now. It's only seven. Uh, I don't know if I can do it with this weight. Uh, yeah, I can't keep can't keep good form with that. Wish I had like seven and a half at this point. I gotta use fives, which is gonna seem a lot easier. I gotta hit my penalty reps. Hey Google, volume three. I just thought I would change up the, the format today just to show you what the, the workout looks like for me. I mean, usually I'll be in the gym doing weights, but when it's something like this, and you know, I'll be working all day. I've got plenty of equipment at home to, to really get most of the workout in. So after this, I got some more ab work and then I got shoulder press and I've got 20 pound dumbbells for that. So I can really make sure to finish in the right way. Thing is, thing is I can barely walk right now. My foot, I don't know. Probably just more miles than what I'm used to. 
I got like a stabbing pain on the bottom of my foot. Every time, every time I put any, any weight on it. So I, I stretched out with the with the tennis ball. I know that's one of the things you want to do. You want to like stand, stand on a ball and roll your foot over the top of it. But uh, didn't really do everything for it. Oh. Oh. Well, I don't have anything else. I'm gonna get back to it. I'm gonna keep going. I got like three more, two more exercises after I finish these. I got two more sets of each of these, and then two more exercises, and then that's that's the workout. I think I'll probably. As I usually do, I'll probably get to the end and say, I'm not done yet, let me do more. Uh, today's probably more at work. So I might end with like 25 Russian twists on the side and then uh, make some mountain climbers. That seems like a solid way to wrap up. So I'll probably do that and then call that the, call that the end of the workout. But, you know, just thought I would switch it up. It, you know, everyone's everyone's working, but this is the level that I, I try to perform at every day. Just I look in the mirror and it's, it's me against me. That's competition every day. So I'll be back at it. Let me know if you like this kind of switch up of the more of a more of an insight into some of the stuff I'm doing too. So this is day day six. Tomorrow's workout will be the first first week complete. Once I finish everything tomorrow and. First week out of you know 11 weeks and it's a, it's a keep going until november we got travel coming up too so you know it'll be it'll be interesting to see see how that impacts the the consistency and the, the level that i'm performing at but it's obstacles you want to make it harder on purpose so that you that way everything else in life is easier so that's what we're here to do all right god bless